Uh, ladies and gentlemen, we are we are so back. We're we're so back. All right, guys. So welcome back to the channel. As I'm sure you can tell from this alone and well, probably the title of this video, today we have a pretty fun unboxing. We have two brand new inbox locomotives. Those being Splatter and Dodge to not only unbox but take a look at. And these are the classic Trackmaster versions of the two. The uh, actual hit toy company releases of them and yes again new in box these have not been opened they are completely sealed uh it looks like at least on splatter these cars or the uh little things that hold them the little bands or uh rubber bands that probably do are busted so that's a little weird it looks like splatters or the locomotives are just fine and it doesn't seem dodge has that problem at all but again it, the tape is fine unless it was retaped you know by the person before me these should be mint in box. And you know, with that fact alone, it does make it a bit painful to uh, open these two up. But, you know, we're going to do our best to keep these boxes intact. And once they are, you know, this review's done, I've played with them. We'll probably put them back in this and uh, up for display. So enough of all of that. Let's just get into this review. All right. So it's looking like the two largely share the same box. It's a uh, pretty typical for the uh, hit toy company. It's got this blue background we've got little thomas logos and tickets there the trackmaster logo there on the side the classic trackmaster logo i should add and here on the bottom of both there are little plates that let you know it's splatter or dodge the fronts these sometimes would have a window where you could see the face of the engine it looks like on these two yeah it's just uh pictures of what's in the pack once it's unboxed and that sadly is on both sides the top is pretty much the same as the top you get another window to show you the top of the pack and another little name thing oh and another trackmaster logo now i think the real highlight of these boxes is the back because just just look at all of this nostalgia look at that thomas pack we have the percy the james pack arthur dodge rosie emily lady bill spencer duncan donald reneas diesel 10 splatter ben douglas stepney all right screw the boxes let's just go ahead and jump into these things now they are in pretty good condition again so i want to do my best to you know not mess up that fact let's just go ahead and carefully break that tape seal and slide these things out of here all right come on gently there we go and ah, uh, there we go ladies and gentlemen just look at that just okay this is my first time ever having a new inbox splatter so this is oh my god just look at wow all right ladies and gentlemen so here i did not expect that oops all right well it looks like everything's now separated let's go ahead and take a look here at splatter so this is the locomotive and just I can't lie. I can't. Splatter and Dodge are some of my favorite diesel characters, and seeing them in uh, this Tomy or Trackmaster form, that doesn't change at all. Just just look at that goofy face. Look at this beautiful purple against that gray. He's so unique. He's It's just such a unique character, especially when there's so many different awaits. These two always manage to stick out, at least to me. Now, again, it's looking like this Splatter is mint. There's not a single bump on him. This thing is just, just crisp. The face is looking great. The paintwork looks amazing. The name is still very much intact on the side. This is really cool. This is a crisp little engine. And he also comes with this kind of olive green almost. Hell, we'll call it a works fan because uh, that's probably what I'm going to use it for. Here we have a offish green works fan that he pulls right behind him. And another, this is a little interesting. I did not expect this of all things to be in this pack. It's uh, still kind of jarring to see even now. We have a bright blue, or uh, almost baby blue, uh, I don't know, maybe it's more royal blue. It's just a cattle van, a blue cattle van, and that's just, why? You know, when I think of Splatter, I don't think of that to be the first thing he'd pull, but I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty unique, I do like it. This thing definitely will look pretty cool in whatever consist. They just, they, these feel so random, like, as a pairing. Like, why? Why these two? I, I don't know. I don't know. That, that, that's just my thoughts. You know what? That's my thought. What, what do you think, Rosie? What do you think about all this? Here are, the, here are these cars, Miss Girl. What do you think, at least about the works unit? Tell me about the works unit. I think she's more interested in the box. Cattle van? Is the cattle van? 
I think that one's getting a sign of approval. What about Splatter? Not back to the box, back to the box. Looks like Splatter has to do better next time. That's just, sorry, that's from Rosie, not me. All right, really quick, just a little bit of background on these engines since I'm sure some of you guys are curious. So Splatter and Dodge were available in a few different ways. Starting all the way back in 2001, the pair were released as a pair, and this was largely how it was up until 2008, when Trackmaster decided to split the packs where Playrail and Tomica sold them together. Both the Splatter and Dodge packs came out in 2008, but the two would also have some singular engine releases, these known as the Little Friends, which only included the engine and a half piece of track. Now, this is something you've probably already noticed, but the models themselves aren't exactly perfect. They're the same mold as Diesel, and as such, inaccurately wear ladders on their front end. But to be fair, that's really my only criticism, and it's kind of an understandable one. Kind of strangely though, in 2009, the Ironworks twins got models without them, so it's kind of strange Splodge never got that same treatment. Alright, so for now I'm just going to slip that, and oh, for, we have a little instruction booklet. We'll slip that back in there as well. Again, I want to keep this in as good condition as I can, despite what Rosie wants. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we take a look at Dodge, so let's go ahead and bust into this guy, same as before. Just try to be very careful with uh, breaking that tape seal. Open that carefully, and oh my god, here we go. Just, just, just look at that. Look at that face immediately. Bro is tweaking. All right, let's go ahead and pull this guy out too. Try not to flip him and possibly mess anything up this time. All right, let's take this car out first. Get this one out as well. There we go. And now we get. The engine. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's get into this. So it's looking like this is the Trackmaster Dodge. And I, this is the only one I think I managed to get as a kid. I think I found this one in a Walmart or something. Rosie is having a blast with those wagons. I think this is the only one I managed to find as a kid. So I have a little bit of experience with Dodge. Yeah, like I said earlier, this one is tweaking. Just, just look at those eyes. We've got a little bit of paint that comes off the face onto the front here. It's a little bit less clean, I guess, but still. It's a mint locomotive. There's no bumps or scratches on him. The paintwork looks pretty damn smooth. I mean, a little bit there in the cab, too. I, could be done a little bit smoother, but it's still a brand new in box freaking Dodge. I, I can't really complain. Let's see, a little bit of a mold issue there at the back. Save for that, this thing is, yeah, like I said, pretty much mint. This is a beautiful little dude. And I think these two will go together pretty damn well on the railway. But what exactly does this guy come with wagon-wise? Well, just like Splatter, there's this little works van coach thing. So now we have two of these. It's really nothing too special, I want to say. It's very unique. I'll give it that. It, it looks... It's, it's basically just a works coach. There you go. Two works coaches. And this one makes a little bit more sense, I guess. But it's still a... Uh, it's still kind of random to be with these two characters of all things. Uh, Dodge comes with this. What is this? Is this like a... I think these are bricks. Maybe... Maybe red slate? I don't know. Little crates with orange bricks or just something inside of them. And uh, it, there's no face on it. It's basically just a faceless truck. I mean, at least there's a load. I'll say that. You know, that's a lot more than most Trackmaster packs get. So that's... That's pretty cool. And here's a closer look at that load if anyone was curious. They're pretty unique looking. It's uh, looks like these are little pallets and inside of them, again, I, I, I don't know, little red slate. That's the first thing my head goes to, I guess. One by one Roblox tiles. There you go, that's, that's what they are. So wagon wise, again, in this pack, we've got one faceless troublesome truck with a uh, strange red crate load. We've got a blue cattle van, which, uh, I'm not gonna lie, this one might be taking my favorite piece of rolling stock just because it's so what. We've got two little work coaches and the best things in my opinion, the, the best parts, Splatter and Dodge. And you know what? I think this completes the Thomas and the Magic Railroad collection, at least in a Tomy Trackmaster. I've got Diesel 10, Lady, now Splatter and Dodge, Thomas. You know what? This is gonna be a fun running session. But with all of that being said, let's move all of this stuff back to the train table, get these boxes back intact, and ladies and gentlemen, 
Let's go run some trains. I'd like to start off by thanking our sponsor for financing the parts for this Frankenstein monster, along with my partner who's a bro of two words. He did this research for two nerds and two birds. Keanu, do a show at the same time, watch it. And guaranteed to give him more than just hot speed. MC extraordinaire, technique sorta of rare. Quarter clear, sorta of scared, next week more to share. From the most retardedest artists this year and forever. Feeling them, you mean big brothers love ya. Definitely felonies telling me, treacherously MC yelling, be set him free. Let me see, that strategy's misleading. G's all in the freezer with the batteries and zooming. Hear him stalk the concrete with Bunyan. It won't hurt corns when it's on like the stun gun. Not so shocking, for them face rappers eat rocks over beatboxing. Debunk punks with a stock flow and make it funky fresh with no socks. Wahako, mad villain been as high as Cat Man do. Tilted to the side like that fat man's shoe Look, not to give a mixed signal The rap game got more toys than Kris Kringle And he's fake, your ears is not deceiving I can't believe my eyeballs no more than Steven No wonder, OMFG Snuck him like an unexpected blow from a lefty Caught me, almost shot an eye out Felt good though, even with the cotton dry mouth Time out, okay time back in Never seen a living human being with black skin What's cracking? Besides smoking trees and reason With no reason working like a broken tetrahedron We get paid and get even Building Still get mad when it's time to get good <laughs> Good They thought the dawn had gone silent Since deep in his studies he's accepted non-violence Don't make him have to skip some classes And open up an old can of whoop ass with the fastness Cut the roll of melatonin put a little more in Strip club full of whores and grown men snoring Keep the block sold like bread and bobbin bonus And make sure the seeds know they never ever own this Beat a dead pony and sell the corpse for glue Get a portion off the proceeds for the shoe No need to bleed if there's no big to do Flew a fly flow with the speed of Mr. Magoo Blew a wad on a platinum card debit Come back broke as hell, ask the guard for credit, get it the mask is like a handcrafted ghillie suit Only if the ladies can see him, they say it's really cute mm, Thanks in advance Don't try to be cool now, had your chance Avalanche, rappers is Badger Vance Acting, who need to fix their pants or get smacked by the Mac-10 Or 11 Or both Find Jesus, see the reverend take the oath He moves his huge hands in the dark like fate Waiting for the date to drop the tape like bait My generation, we drink because it's good. Because it feels better than unbuttoning your collar. Because we deserve it. We drink because it's what men do. Keep your mind on your mask, kid. Horror form a classic, it's drastic. Filling the hydrochloric acid, splashed it. Pulling out, reached and blasted. Pow! Pin stripes on a basket. We all style, wow. Shut it, grab easy. It's only entertainment, though. When thought out completely. That demeanor could get him the drop and bag cleaner Master schema, expert in that arena Puff in Pasadena, you read the grass was greener Black Beamer, I ate gyrate Rubbing shoulders with pigs who don't fly straight Just ate, causing indigestion Will soon regurgitate, ain't your profits no question Nosy agents sniffing around Pay attention, you can take that to the bank Thanks, don't mention it, pleasure's all mine Ain't mad at y'all, clear advantage like playing paddle ball on Adderall Be great, that is all Aight, one more rhyme Self-snitching rappers with lines of pure pork rhymes Yo, Either, either, either subscribe, donate, or get the fuck out.